So today's project, guys, is a Luke's lamp on a budget. I am starting with 1 by 5 by 8. And I got this length of wood at Home Depot for exactly $8.46. Now, originally I planned on using this for the base. And this um, is a regular wood plaque 7 by 7 that I got at the craft store. Now, I cut four pieces of 16 inch length which is going to be, you know, the um, body of the lamp itself. And then I cut two pieces of four and a half by five, I think it was, for the top and the bottom. And I'm gluing them together with wood glue. Now, I didn't bother to put a bottom on the lamp. So it's just basically um, putting the glue on the wood and gluing the pieces together. So I started by gluing three pieces together, leaving that to dry. And I just kind of um, use some books to, kind of, um, to hold the pieces in place and let that dry. Now this um, glue dries fairly quickly so within 20-30 minutes you will be able to move on to the next. But don't use too much because if you have seepage this is what's going to happen to you. It actually glued on the cardboard that I was working on but it wasn't really hard to get it off. So, But just be careful. Next I glue the other side. And notice that I'm gluing the, I'm putting one side in the middle between two walls, and I just flipped it over and left that to dry. Next, I had to drill holes for the core to go through at the back, at the bottom, and I then also had to drill a hole um, on the top piece using a two inch drill bit. Now on the top piece, remember those two pieces you saw me cut, that's where the lamp kit is going to go through for the bulb and the harp and so forth. Okay, I am sorry, I thought I was filming at that time, but I wasn't. So I'm not going out to buy me a new lamp kit because that can run you $12 to $15. I have a lamp that broke and I saved the kit. I actually have two of them. One is silver and one is gold, but I want to use the gold one. However, with the gold one, the um, where the cord attaches inside the socket you can't get in there so once I cut that off I am gonna have to find a different socket to use now I didn't want to make a trip to Home Depot so I just used the socket from another old lamp that I had which allows me to attach the wires with this one I can't get into there to put the wires back so this is the other socket that I had. This is a pull string one, doesn't bother me at all. And you just wrap the wires around those screws to get the electricity to the bulb. Um, very simple, very easy. However, I'm not an electrician, so you can check other videos to see how to put it all together. But basically, this is me. If you notice, I have painted the um, lamp a gray, and I'll put the... Um, the coloring that I use, it's a Sharon Williams, or is it? No, I, I can't remember, but I'll put it in. And I'm just um, running the lamp kit through the lamp up into the top portion there and just attaching everything. It's fairly simple and easy. I had a little problems because the, um, the pipe was a little within which I ran the, um, the, the cord through was a little short so I had to struggle with it somewhat but um, it worked out so now that I've done that I can glue on the top a little out of focus so sorry guys but I just use the same wood glue then I whatever you know when you work with wood you generally have gaps sometimes because no piece of wood is perfectly even so I'm just filling that with um, caulk painters caulk um, it's, I think this is actually acrylic caulk and what I like about this is that it dries very easily. Um, not made for wood but worked fine for me. I think I need a new um, saw for my, my um, saw, new um, blade for my saw. So for the embellishment I just got um, a couple of baskets from Dollar Tree because I like that design that's right there. Now I use a, um, a utility knife as well as a scissors. They're that flimsy that you can actually cut them with a scissors. 
um, to cut out, you know, the area that I wanted. Then I laid it on the lamp to kind of measure exactly where I want to cut it because I don't want, didn't want it to cover the entire face of the the um the body of the lamp. And then I just use a ruler to run a straight line and cut following that line. So I sprayed it in metallic gold, and then I am just using E6000 glue to glue that on. And there it is. Simple and easy. As usual, I love to hear your feedback, guys. Not a very difficult um, DIY. And as usual, budget friendly. Thank you so much for watching. Bye now.